Good afternoon, everybody. How are you guys doing? Five Arm is on time. I'm late because you reminded me to install Bears of the North, which should be good to go now. Hail and well met to Dragon's Blood. Leftover chicken and fries for Amorali. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm more of a leg guy, really. <laughs> and pro gamer, how are you guys doing? All right, so we're going to, um, yes, at the end of last stream, like after streaming, where is Queen Alpsiga? My queen, come to me to help me get to the next place. Uh, where is it? Where is it? There. Perfect. Good girl. So, uh, yeah, after last stream, I think I figured out how to fix the device in the shack. So I think we can go ahead and um, get the way shrines activated. Uh, I also picked up a book. Did I? Do I have that with me? Or was it in the testing? There was a book. It's probably. Uh, it's probably after we activate the. Uh, the device. We get, we get a book that looks like it's basically screenshots of all the locations of the uh, way shrines. So we can try to figure out where they are. Should be fun. Oh, is this a path? Sort of. Oh, hello. Uh, that is a bandit with a blandit cloaker gale. What does that even mean? Oh, they're attacking my dog. Alright, we've got a new spell, too. Spirit Fire. Let's see how this works. Um... Higher, the drains 14 magic and stamina per second, and when both are depleted, it drains health. Do I have to cast it at a target, or...? Protect the boy! That's right. I was kind of expecting a, a totem or something, you know? Um, okay, magic and stamina are negative. Oh, it's kind of whooshing, making a weird whooshing sound. Okay. We can do that. Huh, interesting. Okay, sure. Maybe slightly injured. I don't really want to run in and attack her with uh, with her cloak going. Oh, but Freaky had no such qualms. Take that. I'm carrying so much junk now. I don't know. All right, that's that. That's that, and you have. You have a great sword. Interesting. A monk mage with a great sword. And uh, oh, we're almost to town. No point in getting on the queen. Give her her, her back a rest. Bears of the North is apparently installed. We'll see how it turns out. Bears of the North basically overhauls all of the Bears into really terrifying monsters. Find a bear cave. 
Uh oh. I have a feeling I'm about to get a delivery of some sort. No? I thought that was the, uh... That was just a kid. Oh, okay. Okay, what are we doing here again? Uh, oh, well, one thing, we're gonna turn in some... items. Old you! Lady Frida is a grouch, but she sure can whip up a cure for the rattles fast. Need something? How can I argue with that? Uh, you can take the longbows. The Nordic bow. I have no hunting bow. Oh, I do have a hunting bow. There you go. I can take that. Uh, the rest of this, I'm not entirely sure if I need to turn it in somewhere. I can give you poisons. There you go. You can also have that. Carrying around tons of these things. Yes. Excellent. Good. Now, let's go to Falkreath. Find a bear cave. Where, where's a good Carrot bear cave? The safest way to travel. Where do you want to go? Going straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? Actually, if you could take me straight to the shack, that'd be great. But Slam I don't think back, you do that. We'll be off. Now the queen's going to be irritated because I'm not riding her to Falkreath. By the way, how's everybody doing today? I'm doing pretty good. It's uh, hot. This is probably one of the hottest days of the year so far. It's like 31, I think. Going to 31, feeling like 40 or so. I'm thirsty. I could have a bit more, but that's okay. Yeah, now now the queen's just like, you don't want to ride me to Falkreath? We'll screw you, bro. Dragon's blood is off. It's always good. Days off. I never get a day off. I work seven days a week. Hell. Hello, Fury. How are you doing? Glad you can make it. Oh, is this another reflected? Yes, I'm finished. Finished. Finished a long time ago. Stop asking me. Now is the queen. Now, see the queen. The queen is just gets very upset very easily and then she won't show up for a while look i'm sorry okay i needed to travel to the other side of the map as tom would say warm sands We got to the shack. Now, this. Uh oh. Well. Let's just not pay attention to that. Can I? Can I like run up this? Sort of. All right. I think I have everything. Hey, and there's Warm Sands himself. Hey, Tom. How are you doing? Okay, so, save, uh, repair the device, yes, Wimmer, gear, tampered, dynamo, and an intact component are all done. Now we have to activate the device, get sucked into another dimension, discover the identity of the apparition and his intentions, what apparition? Uh, apparently that's been completed. Return to Skyrim and conclude 
The end of the beginning. On the metaphysics of moving bodies, salvage the souls of those less fortunate and redeem their prosperity. This sounds wrong. Oh, hello, Freaky. Thank you for joining me in this whatever it is. Oh, I actually consumed that. Now we've got soul salvage soul. A Dunmer. Final wish, I'll take that. I believe I need these. Unfortunately. Final wish. To anyone that finds this, if that's even a possibility, please take my research. And don't skip to the next page until you finish reading. Continue it and embrace it. My final wish is to allow me to rest peacefully knowing that the Snow Elven technology has been conclusively solved. The way shrines among Skyrim's land are not the individual Enetomorphs? En Something like that? Uh, we take them for. They are much more than that. Pieces of cultural architecture designed to create a network of spiritual transportation. The Snow Elves somehow managed to manipulate phantasmal channels creating weak connections between Nern and Therius and use it to their advantage. My only question now is what would possibly occur if all way shrines were active? If all channels simultaneously resonated through the realms, could that be enough energetic demand to allow mortal passage into Etherius? I can feel my time running out, which is ironic due to the fact I felt dead weeks prior. I, uh, this place, it is not of the usual nature us mortals are used to. I cannot sense time, nor do I yearn for sleep. This find is overwhelming. Even I cannot fathom such a revelation. The great Lord Corvus de... de... Press the button. Another hand presses the button. It looks like your garage after the last storms. Ooh. Hello, Oslam. How are you doing? Okay, so we need to activate the conduit. You do not possess the required amount of soul energy. So unfortunately, I didn't realize that this was like... Kind of foul necromancy sort of stuff. We need... Is it a power? Soul salvage. There you go. Currently have zero soul energy. Which of these souls would be worthy of a pardon? Oh, a pardon. Okay, that's interesting. What do I? What am, what am I carrying? What, what did I just pick up from him? Two black souls. Yeah, let's definitely release them. Do not use mortal souls. Uh oh. But we're releasing these guys. Black. Two of. That didn't sound good. I still don't have. But. No? Still don't have enough? What happens if I use mortal souls now that I've used mortal souls? I need to reload. Negative soul energy. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I thought I was releasing them. <sighs> okay, we'll redo that. It was a shriek of relief. It doesn't sound like relief, but okay.
two grand soul gems. There we go. Okay, save. Yeah, like aren't we releasing them from the from being trapped in the soul gem? That sounds good. Doesn't it? No. The apparatus in the bronze water cave might help with black salts. Hmm. Okay. Let's do uh do. There we go. Discover more way shrines to fulfill Corvus's final wish. Oh, hello. Architonic? Is that what that said? Yeah, architect ar arca architectonic renditions. Disclaimer, this journal is but a rough draft of what I intend to be a larger collection of historical architecture I may come across during my travels within Skyrim. I plan to stroke this, these barren pages with the finest mixture of oils to truly capture the memorandums such constructs display. Additionally, I believe these, those whom are sibyls of the Debilin Arts, will be pleased. Okay. You don't know. You don't say. Uh, these ruins fascinate me. In fact, there is little known about them is what wears my sanity thin. As I venture throughout the lands of Skyrim, I've noticed there is more than just one of these ruins. Way shrines, they call them. Embedded in the skin of Nern is simple yet intriguing reminders of the historical events which once occurred on the very same grasses, rocks, and snow we trek today. They differ from the Aeliad ruins back in Cyrodiil, possibly suggesting that the intentions and structural integrity are of separate make. It worries me that not many passers-by absorb the fine artistry that the Way Shrines provide. They treat them no more than that of aged architecture built by ancestral Nords. Therefore, I have decided to take it upon myself to create a personal rendition in the form of a collage to expose the beauty of the unique architecture that was once constructed by the burdened snow elves. Uh, okay, how stunning. This was the very first shrine I stumbled upon after crossing the border into Skyrim. The rest is just outside Falkreath, conveniently along the road. It seems they've made quite the effort to rid it of its interference with road work. Okay, we've already discovered that one. This Riverwood Way, Riverwood Way, Way Shrine appears to move alongside with the Grace of Nern. The boulders in the forest provided a perfect angle to capture its nature. Shame, as this would have been a great spot to build a ca build the cabin in the woods near the river. Okay. I don't know if we found that one. But, for now, we are going to head into uh, the Reach. We can actually get rid of this. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we could clear Bile Gulch Mine as we head in this direction. Oh, there's also a steel shield I gotta get over there. Hmm. I really I want to hit these up and uh, clear out these um, quests over here. Yeah, we got a lot, lot to do. Now, if the uh, if the queen would just deign to join me, look at how much stamina we've got. We can just like run, run along in full plate armor, no problem. Did 
Did I miss my turn? Nope. I think so. Oh, there she is. She's like, I'm here. I'm here. Yeah, we might actually run into a bear in the reach. It does actually uh, sound a lot like like a uh, kind of a flowery instruction manual. <laughs> All right, so there's one down. Wow, her majesty requires summons in the form of fine parchment with gold dust infused ink and a gift of the finest apples to come to your... Uh, eh, never mind, she's here. <laughs> we did all of that uh, off camera. <clears throat> yep. These are almost in opposite directions. Actually, I should probably go that way. Uh, not through the ruins, though. But this way. Need to activate what? Who? What? Oh, there's a bear. Bear. Okay, that bear. Killed a deer while being on top of a ridge. That's interesting. Where did it get off to? Bear. Bear. Let's have, um, there's a Spirit fire ready. What? Where did he? He was right here. What? Ah, uh, bear? I am unbearable. Okay. Bear. Bear just tuck off. Okay. Well, uh, hopefully we will run into him or another one soon. Oh, hey, I think I see a... Uh, I think I see a sky shard. Look at that. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Get, get off, get off, up. Climb off of the, oh, there's a bear. Okay, we got, we got them all. We got all the things, okay, you. Oh, I'm getting hit by another one. And, oh, look at this thing. Oh. I think Freaky uh, took care of the bear. Look at that thing. Ooh. I'm getting a little lag here because of that fine fur. <laughs> okay. Well, that's, that's our first one of those, Dan.
The bear just used invisibility. That would make sense. Oh, wait. What is that? That looks like a ball. Oh, boy. Read about Mana Marco. Alchemy insight? Really? It's a chungus and it is also very uh, laggy, but that's okay. They're kind of cool. All right, how far off the uh, trail did we get? Passing through. Mind me. That's close enough. I don't even have the 4K version of the bears installed. Oh god, what the hell is that? Fire on you. Did I hit them? I don't think they actually know how to be anything execution order. Uh, my... Mm, what do I... I think I only... I do have an illusion spell to detect dead. I don't use any alteration, just restoration. Oh, I didn't actually read Final Wish this time. There you go. Execution order, you say? What? Uh, where is it? There. Be on the lookout for the Imperial called Augustus Tiberius Caligula. He is an enemy to the Thalmor and has actively disrupted our activities and caused great harm. If spotted, you're to destroy him with extreme hatred. Is that like extreme prejudice? I have not actually uh, used Morphogenesis yet. I should, next time I see a bear, I should uh, try to remember to cast that on it. I've attempted to use it, but yes, not successfully. Not that I'm aware of, anyway. Hi, Simon. How are you doing? Glad you could join us. Uh, be advised, he's extremely dangerous and quite able to defend himself. If caught by local authorities, we are unable to offer you any assistance. For the glory of the old Mary. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. I'm, am I going in the right? No, I'm going sort of in the wrong direction, kind of. Oh, that's why he yelled Morpho. Right. That would make sense. Oh, we'll, we'll give that another try later. I go up here. Never wait, remember which one of these is the right. Oh. Uh. Freaky's getting involved with a spider? No, actually, Freaky's not involved at all. Yeah. Where's Freaky? 
boy? Boy. Where are you, boy? Okay. Oh, there you are. Good boy. Oh, I could use a nap now. of healing. That sounded like a creature. Oh, okay. They've got a trained troll. And did, that, did that do anything for me? Tell if that's working. Wait, are you planning on shooting me or what's going on over there? You know what? I am running out of space for everything. I'm just going to stop picking up things and I'm just going to warn the, um, I'm just going to let the guards know that I've, yeah, go for it. Go for it, boy. You can do it. I'm just going to warn, uh, let the guards know that I've cleared out these bandits. How do I know if morphogenesis worked? Like, should it be, like, be in here somewhere? Hmm. How did this, how did that orc die? Strange. Um, what does mend injury do? Again, I have it on here and I don't know what it actually does. Fully repairs mutilated bodies such as those ravaged by war or disease. Okay, whatever. Not gonna bother using that. And Finity. As if we need to make him even stronger than he already is. But here you go, Ricky. Enjoy. You a bad time to get Let's do, um, spirit fire on you. Oh, look at that. Wow. Okay, so you have to cast it on them, but then they don't actually... They have to stay within range of it. There. Interesting. Okay. So I was thinking like it was something you could cast on the ground, but you can't. You have to actually cast it at, a, at an enemy. Yeah, it's possible trolls are just not... not valid. I guess I'll take that. Iron Mace of Crystals. Do I? Do I have that? I don't know. All right, that is done. Another quest removed from our list. Well, it's not actually completely completed. We have to turn it in, but 
You know what I mean. Okay, we can definitely go return the sword. We can also go find the amulet of Debella. You don't need to follow me up here, although I do appreciate the support. Really? The Witcher villain combat music chorus is continued just saying hopscotch over and over in Farsi? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's absolutely amazing. Lay lay as hopscotch. Hopscotch. That's really cool. So, um, like, um, uh, Co Carnage made uh, the lay lay, uh, just the lay lay part of that song, uh, made that a um, a thing. Like, a, like chat. If chat posts, I think it's Co Lay. Uh, if enough people post that in chat, it will pop up a notification and he plays the plays the sand tune. That's really cool. So they're like hopscotch. You beat that you beat that boss. Hopscotch. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. I gotta I gotta tell Girl Got Game about that. Hey Damien, um, something you could do is go to Wabajack and check that out. There's a, there's a huge mod list there, and they've already been um, like sorted out for compatibility and all that. And it uh, the the program will automatically download and install all the mods. Although if they have links to um, to the Nexus, some of those mods may no longer function, unfortunately. Hopscotch, hopscotch, hopscotch. That's absolutely incredible. Shrine of Magus. Now, this is an impressive one. This is I like this one way better than the, the Temple of the Ancestors. Uh, no. No, I just, uh, I just want to pray. Thank you. To my own god. Put this, opened the stream early, went to do something, came back, missed 20 minutes, and I was in another dimension. <laughs> Mages can totally have abs. Not all mages are, you know, have their noses uh, buried in dusty, t dusty old tones. I did not work out Headhunter. I I suspect that the problem I was having, but I ha haven't confirmed this yet. I suspect that the issue is it may not have been triggering on existing uh, quests, existing uh, bounties that I had. And so like I went to clear a bounty that I already had and there was no, there was no trophy. So. Maybe that's the problem. I hope that's the problem. Uh, but yeah, I haven't actually had a chance yet. I've been so busy. I'm actually really having a hard time staying ahead of um, the Forgotten Cryomancer and this. And also working on the la the uh, Dwemer Mage. Uh, yeah, too many things going on. Besides work, you know, regular, just regular work. 
If only we could play video games all the time. Uh, there is my good friend. I have Jolty's sword. It's been an honor to serve you, brother. Remember our lessons from the sword masters of Alcair? Let me show It will you only affect new quests. Okay, forgotten. perfect. Before and since I'm focusing on just clearing out quests that I already have right now, uh, I thought I would just wait uh, a little bit on that. Your face actually doesn't look too bad. Oh, right, it's this, this mod listed works fine. The, the kids' faces. Okay, that is done. Now, Good to see you. can I tell you about the, no. That's too bad. Can I get some water? Of course. Perfect, and what do you have as I far as look. food is concerned? Uh, a boiled egg, yum. I'm still not going to get dog meat stew, okay? Nope. Nope. Vegetable soup. I'll have that. And some venison chop. All right, then. And how are we doing? I know I was getting a bit tired earlier. Slightly tired. Slightly thirsty. Peckish. Okay, we have time. So I can just install it and then whatever, it'll just affect new quests. Okay. Um, hmm. We want to go all the way around? I guess we probably should. It's relatively close. I go this way? This... Hmm. It looks like it's on top of that cliff, not... not in the side of the mountain. Well, we might be able to get up here. Maybe. This look looking promising. I think we're up on the plateau, just fine. Yes. Ish. Okay, we have to go to the go to the right up. Uh, Freaky, could you deal with the, that uh, wolf for me? Thank you. Kjalti Early Beard, named so because, oh god, whoa, they are doing a lot of damage. What the hell is that? Here, take, take that. Ah. Jeepers! What is it with these vamp- oh, there's more. Oh, she just bashed my horse! She's bashing my horse in the face! What? Ow, she missed. Good. She's- she's- she's literally bashing my horse! How dare you! Who do you think you are? I'm, 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 I'm swinging right through. Oh no, she's glitched. There we go. Holy crap. No, you don't attack my horse. Speaking of. Ah, oh, another wolf. Leave. The queen alone. Okay, let's go check out this uh, mage up here. Holy crap, she was doing a lot of damage. Um, there you are, hiding in the grass.
Aha. Mm hmm. Right. Smite the heathen that struck the queen. Indeed. How dare you do such a thing? Well, let's cast this. Let's cast this. And let's cast. Because I know that there are beasties in here. Detect dead. Really? There is dead in here. to Stendar while you can. Rosclaw can expel Daedra. Okay. Alright. This, this has a very uh, creepy red glow in here. Ah, uh, you okay, girl? Here. There. That was a good girl. Yeah, I could have... You, you want me to pray to him? I, I could have, of course, prayed to him and asked him for uh, assistance, basically. Yeah. 158. Nice. Okay, so... Over here, I think... Is it the, um... Is it the spot that has the, um... The Hagraven? Kinda looks like it. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Amorelli F5. Well, I think it's in there. And there's also a Sky Shard. Divisions of opportunity. Now oh, he's doing it. Oh, 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 easy. Oh, they're getting wrecked. Why is this uh, Briarheart only level 7? Awesome. Got the first one from Whiterun Hold. The first video in the recommended feed of this stream is titled Photogenic Banana, and I do not know what to do with the information. <laughs> oh, let me uh, okay your comment there, 
five arm. Yeah, no question. This shield is really beautiful. And we're going to make the, um, the enchanted version as well. Where's the... There's, there's that. F5 on it. Don't step on that. There's nothing out there. Let's give the dog some assistance along with ourselves. Visions of healing is good. I do like both of them, really. Let's see. Let's just take a look at what they do again. Visions of healing uh, curses random foes within 40 feet, absorbs health from targets. Very nice. And opportunity uh, reduces armor and magic resist. That's also really nice. I wish you could have both of them active at once. Come on down, guys. Come on down. Oh, I got injured. To go and deal with that, that'd be great. Thank you, Freaky. He's done. She has crafting feathers that are marked as a skull. Five arm. This one has heard that it is dangerous in Skyrim to F5 while on a horse. Really? Oh, that's interesting. Let's actually F5 right here. And... No, I assumed we were actually here to, um... To... Kill... Oh, we're here for the, for the shrine. The uh, thing... Uh, not the shrine, the uh, amulet. Oh. Whoops. Did I... Did I just pick that burned book up? Ruined book. I got dropped. No, stop picking it up. <laughs> what's, what's going on? Stop picking it up. There. Perfect. What is an amulet of Debella, a lost amulet of, of Debella doing here anyway? Ooh, paralysis rune. Oh, that would be so nice. I already have twin secrets, okay. Anything else? Mm, no, everything good. True. Yeah, I mean, uh, this is much more of a vigilant aesthetic than the, the new armor. We do have a little ways to go still before we can do that. First, we need 10,000 gold to pay off our bounty before we can even get into Whiterun. And then we can make the new stuff. Which is going to cost a lot and take a lot of, um, probably a lot of resources. Okay, that quest is also complete. Nice. Well, it's pretty much a run down to uh, to Markarth now. Oh, look at that beautiful view. It's sadly obscured a bit and messed, but still gorgeous. Can anybody recommend a good uh, Vanilla Plus Wabajack list? I know there's a lot of lists on there. Whoa. What was that? Well, that is a saber cat that needs to die, obviously. Oh! 
I don't think that was supposed to happen. But what is this thing? On the head. Hell Crown Yakundan Shrine. Oh, Shrine of Tall Papa. Morwa. Kunding and Lecky. Okay, cool. Wow, this is this is very fancy. Hello, Pyrosols. Oh, right, I cut oh, I'm sorry, yeah, I could have done the morph. Gotta try and remember <laughs> remember when I run into a uh, an animal of pretty much any any kind of animal. Uh, okay, good. There's a path. Steep path, but there's a path. Uh, if there's a Wabajack list that installs all of um, either Anis or Simon Magus's uh, Vanilla Plus mods, that would be good. That'd be that'd be a great uh, mod list for like a vanilla plus experience. Did I just murder that uh, that goat with my horse? My thundering horse hooves. Yeah, um, both of them have really good, both Simon and and I have excellent, excellent um, vanilla plus perk overhauls, uh, magic overhauls, uh, race overhauls. Oh boy. The locals are coming to say hello. Um, standing stone overhauls. Combat. I'm not sure if Simon has a has his own combat overall. Hey, Onida. Onida, how are you doing? Good to see you. Mounted her pursuit her suicide. Nice. Not familiar with Wabba and you don't know Jack. That's nice. <laughs> Does anybody know actually if Wabba Jack is still working okay with uh, all the mods removed off of Nexus? I assume it links to a lot of uh, Nexus mods. Everybody does like different things. Damien's just getting into modding and wants to try a vanilla plus experience. Well, I can highly recommend uh, Adamant, the Adamant perk overhaul, which is uh, part of Simon's um, mod uh, collection. That's what I'm using in this playthrough. I'll give you a quick look. Uh, let's start with the uh, smithing. Okay, so smithing, you got uh, blacksmith too, which increases your ability. You can temper all items, uh, one level and then two levels. Basic styles opens up steel and leather. Journeyman opens up um, dwarven steel plate scaled. And so forth, rare, so forth, so forth. Rare styles is for elf, exotic for glass, mythic for daedric and dragon. Um, advanced styles for ebony and intermediate styles for Nordic and Orcish. Over here you can temper armor and shields by an additional tier, weapons by an additional tier, and all items by an additional tier. So that's a little bit, it's, you know, very similar to vanilla, but a little bit different. 
Uh, heavy armor. We got Juggernaut for more effectiveness and reduces the weight. Immovable. You can ignore incoming stagger. Uh, you got 25% uh, bonus to armor rating when wearing three pieces. So you don't need... This is one of the things I really like about Adamant specifically, is that you only need three pieces of armor. So for the first part of this playthrough, I was using um, boots, gauntlets, and an invisible helmet from another mod so that I could wear uh, robes. And that, now I've made armored robes, so I took the helmet off. So uh, that's, that's one of the things I like about that, that you don't need a full set. And um, Ni takes a different approach. He has a perk where you can remove your helmet, but still basically have the same armor. So that's kind of cool. You could take less damage from arrows. Um, basically increase your armor rating again. Less attack dam less damage from power attacks and so on. So that, that's some of the perks. I'm not going to go through them all, obviously, but give you sort of a little taste of what the adamant perk overhaul is like. I'm also... I think I'm using... I can't remember if I'm using Mysticism, which is Simon's, or Odin's, which is Ni's uh, magic overhaul. Not entirely sure. Hello, unlimited power. And of course, Ordinator is huge. There's also the Vo what is it called? Vocrinator Black, which combines perks from uh, Ordinator, Vocri, I think Adamant, um, Spurg. <laughs> Combines them all into one giant tree. Okay, so we need to... I still don't know what this is. What, what is this? Kill the chick trader or buy the orphan in Markarth. Like, what does that even mean? It's pointing me... Khajiit. Hello? What do you say to 500 gold for a chick? <laughs> How did you... 100 gold. Does the name Jazel mean anything to you? That name is forbidden among the chick traders. Do not mention it again. Yeah, I... Oh, oh no. Uh, massive drop frames. Okay, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to just wait. I hope you guys can hear me. Oof. Massive, massive drop frames. My internet's, like, doing nothing right now. Oh, God, are we back? Just dropped like 3,300 frames in about five seconds. Oh man. Ordinator does allow a lot of different, um, a lot of different play styles, that's for sure. It enables a lot of things. Whoops. Sorry. Could we just continue our. You can return any time to buy. This one never stops selling. How did you enter the city? You believe Khajiit cannot enter cities. This is very, very disturbing. It is as easy as weighing down the guard's pockets, and if a Khajiit dom donates some to the Jarl, then he receives the same protection as the others, no? Everything sound was okay? It was just frames dropping? Okay. I think everything's okay now. Do not make a mistake and get upset. Even a vigilant must obey the law, yes. Okay, so now my the quest The quest is Kill the Trader 
or by the orphan. Thanks, Anita. Okay, that was weird. I'm surprised that the audio stayed okay. And we actually didn't, didn't disconnect at all. I, I guess my internet didn't just... Sometimes it just completely drops. Where do you get the orphans? Perhaps in a burned, abandoned village, or perhaps in the forest on the town outskirt? Yes, uh, but perhaps a couple may abandon a child when they have nothing to eat. Do you kidnap them, but you also sometimes take. Do not misunderstand. This one does not work. Does this work to, on the behest of the people? Khajiit is not kidnapping anyone, yes? Hmm. I don't know about that. How did you end up working as a chick, tra chick trader? It brings gold, yes? What other reason could there be? What good is work if it does not make money, hmm? It's called a hobby. That is the actual definition of a hobby. <laughs> Even if your hobby doesn't pay well, if it pays you anything, it's technically a job. Quest mod list. Doesn't this hurt your conscience? Why? Hmm? The chick trader gets his gold and the orphan gets someone to feed him, no? The orphans and the chick traders have a wonderful relationship. Oh yes, wonderful. A clever priest could never accomplish something like this, yes? And surely the Khajiit still has, does his good deed of the day. Ah, huh. interesting. You prefer to kill the slavers and drink their blood of my heroic vampire? I mean, I kind of, like, I can't hire, I mean, I can't, um, I can't do anything for the orphan, right? I don't have a house I can take him to. So, Vegeta's going to have to die. Take the orphan to the temple of Stend. Oh, I can actually take the. Oh, interesting. Sorry. You caught me. Take me. Here, just take the bounty. Smart man. Now, come along with us. We'll take any stolen goods, and you'll be free to go. After you pay the fine, of course. Okay. Now I take. Louis. Hello, Louie. Yeah, high five. I know we're kind of standing next to each other, but... So I need to take him to the temple, like, right now. That's... That's kind of unfortunate. Uh, okay. Are you following? Okay. I'm hungry. Of course I am. Are you hungry? That's, that's the more important question. It's a mix of Simon and NIS mods. Okay. All under 2 gig VRAM. Yeah, you probably are going to want to stay under 2 gig VRAM for uh, for a, a laptop. Alright, can we take the... No, I should probably have a little snack quick. Um, vegetable soup. Excellent. Uh, yeah, we should probably take him on the cart instead of riding all the way. PC is a very awkward guardian. <laughs> yeah, like... Stand over here. Hey, kid. Uh, it's the safest way to travel. Even vanilla Skyrim requires two gig. Okay, well that's perfect. Where do you want to go? Uh, I need to go to the pale. Went straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Okay, I'm going to adjust my desk. Hang on. 
whole country's full of them down south. Sorry, I uh, mute it when I put my desk up or down because uh, it's going to be rather unpleasant for you guys. Sweet roll or a carrot? The uh, dinner of champions. Altano, I'm still waiting for my apprentice. What the heck, man? Right this way, kiddo. Got a nice place you can hang out and um, get some food. And you'll be trained to be a great vigilant, just like me. You could have an awesome shield like I have. And a faithful beast. And... Preaky. Ooh, I just got huff hoofed by the queen. Oh, he's kind of... Kinda and lagging behind there. Don't skip leg day, kid. I know we're climbing a mountain, but you know, it'll be over soon. <laughs> You feel the awkward dad energy in your bones. <laughs> boar. Read this, boar. But dad, I can't read that language. Read it. What good are you if you can't read? You can't read, dad. That's because I'm... I've been working on my muscles. <laughs> yep. Roll out the dad jokes, folks. I got paid 100 gold and got a filter of true shot and bread and wine for dropping the kid off. Okay, cool. How you doing? Hmm? Oh, you're, he's talking, but not... Need something? Oh, there you go. Have you gotten used to the job with Vigilant yet? You may have to make some painful decisions sometimes, but don't let that discourage you. Hey, Castle. Um, see that this boy gets a nice uh, warm spot by the fire, some good solid food, and uh, plenty of training, because uh, Alto, Altano is going to probably want him as a new apprentice. So let's get all that done. Let's also sleep here while we're while we're here. Uh, let's pray. I think for once we actually don't have a book to read. Oh, our favor dropped with Stendar. That's unfortunate. I see you've been working on your illiteracy. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Really? The, so when they were recording the voice lines, they didn't have a name for Atreus yet? <laughs> that's really cool. Boy. Um, do I need to eat anything else? Oops. I'm a little bit peckish, but whatever. Um, yeah, we don't have any more 
books. To, uh, nothing to study. Should probably put the, um, Man of Marco book in here. don't really need these. Oh, I can put um, that in here. I was just saving that. Cave bear pelt in there. Got lots of leather. We actually need to do more crafting again. Oh, my favor, favor went down because of the murder. That would make sense. Oh, well. I mean, that guy needed to go. He was, he was bad news. All right. Yes, let's sleep until uh, yeah, seven's probably good. GG, how are you doing, my friend? Good to see you in the chat as always. Do I have, do I have a spot to? There's a spot somewhere around here to uh, to sit for a meal, isn't there? Not in here. Oops. It's on the other side. Oh, it's on the other side. Hello, boy. How are you doing? How's it going, guys? Need something? Uh, no. Need something? I have something for you. No. Uh, how are you doing? It would seem so. Great. Thanks, Tom. Ooh, some potato bread? And oh I'm full. I was gonna have a sweet roll too. And get some water. And some more. Apparently. I have to drink wine in the uh, in the evenings or something all right that is that we didn't actually get anything else done in Markarth while we were there so let's do that shall we yeah it could have been another oh it could have been another uh, repeat of that hmm there's only a 200 uh, gold bounty, thank goodness. I wonder what happened with the afflicted. 10,000 gold is insane. Do I use haste? No. I don't think so. The chick trader got his butt handed to him. I was like, you're totally kidnapping kids and selling them. I didn't want to just buy the orphan from him. I mean, that seems kind of ridiculous. I rode past my stop. You can't kidnap an orphan? Oh. Is kidnap... Kidnapping has to be... Ha... Has to have... Uh, like a, a kid... Kidnapping victim needs to have parents? Where do you want to go? Just an just an abduction then. Uh, the reach. Going straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? It's uh, from the vigilant mod, yeah. 
climbing back and we'll be off. <coughs> City of Markarth, sure is a beauty. No doubt about that. Now we're not Giga Chad yet. That is still coming. <laughs> you know, horrifying, horrifying druid character. Sits in mess, only drinks water, leaves. <laughs> Excuse me. Never should have come here. Thirty Whoa. No, no. What? No sign of it. What happened? What happened there? Does a human heart a meat pie? Vampire? It's a vampire attack. Anyway, GG, $35. Good grief. Thank you very much for the support. Uh, hope it helps and keep up the amazing work as always. Good God, my dude. Thank you so much. That is massive. And believe it or not, I actually set up a... Um, I, I finally set up a uh, Patreon after you asked me uh, months and months ago, but I haven't made it public yet. <laughs> I should really get on that. Anyway, thank you very much. Yep, not, no, can't, can't start the Moleg quests at all. Nope, nope, nope. We got to uh, finish doing the penance quest, which is, how is that doing anyway? Ugh, we still have a lot to go. Talos, Stendar, it, is it a, spe it must be a specific Stendar one, right? Yes, I will let you know, I am, um, I'm trying to figure out what, um, you know, what benefits to give for the for the different uh, tiers. I don't really know. I'm Igman's uncle as well as his steward. Oh. Why, why did we exit a conversation? The same way I advised his father. Caution, caution. I investigated the di disappearance of the two citizens. Unfortunately, they were murdered by a hagraven. I understand. Thank you. Here, this is for you. Oh. Okay, good. Investigation done, apparently. You see, modding stuff is beyond me. I play on Xbox, so the modding is more streamlined, but geez. Yeah, it takes a bit of getting used to, but it's well worth it. Until, of course, your mod list completely breaks and kind of dies. And your entire playthrough is over. Great service. Here is your reward. Eggmund. Need something? Um. Your boots are untied. You expect me to believe that? <laughs> Never try to trick an old guy. Treat my people fairly. And I will do the same to you. Okay. Uh, leader of Deep Red, uh, Deep Wood Readout is dead. I'm impressed. Forsworn usually makes short work of mercenaries, but you took care of them. Here is your reward. I'm surprised I could like turn that in to him. Anyway, not going to ask Good for speaking. more work right now because we are still trying desperately to clear things out. Oh, Amorali, you broke unlimited. Can the orphan you rescued swim? Is he a boy? 
Oh, mm, I need a I need one of those groan sounds on the uh, on a soundboard. <laughs> All right, that is actually cleared out. Can you believe that, guys? We're actually making a dent in some of the quests we have. Matthew is going to be so pleased. Uh, there's the amulet of Stendar. Defeat, defeat the summoner. Right. Uh, then there's the leader up there. There's the amulet of Akatosh. Collect the lost horn of Stendar. That sounds like something we need to prioritize. And. Still need to talk to Atar, but he never leaves his house. Um. Okay, let's let's go the back, back way here and get this amulet. That's the plan. We're gonna make this work. Ah, uh, yes. Let's not talk to him. Stay. You stay on your side of the stream, and I'll stay on mine, guy. Almost done with the quests we currently have in our list. That's... That's where we're at right now. My queen, where are you? You should be here at the horse stable. Hello? Oh no. We're gonna have to whistle. That's a good girl. How you doing? Hey? Ah, uh, yeah. Give you a scritches and a magic apple. That, oh, what? What happened there? Weird. Okie doke. Yeah, so you can just unlock the door with console. Sometimes the mod breaks and people stay behind locked doors forever. Oh, that's that's a good point. Hmm. Does the Adamant Shrines and the amulet mod work with winter sun? I don't know. It probably will need a patch. She's bat bashful in the in the presence of the bachelor horses in Markarth. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Alfsiger. Elfsiger. My, my Nordic is terrible. The Stallion Princes, man, that's... That's, you know, it's kind of awkward. When you're in the presence of such majesty. But she is a queen, though. Is she a single queen is the real question. Is there a way... Is there a way around here that doesn't involve getting Her Majesty's feet wet? They are not compatible without a patch. doing? Oh, we've got a ways to go. Ah, she's gonna... Oh, well, she tried to jump. Shadow Mirror. Sh isn't Shadow Mirror a, f a girl, too? Or is... I mean, it is kind of un an undead demon horse, so I guess it could be anything. Or nothing. Probably more like nothing. 
But uh, frost, definitely. Oh. Ah, there you are. Worried about freaky for a second there. We're getting close. Shadow Mare is, uh, is an undead demon abomination. That's about right. We go in there. Wait. This guy just doing standing out here. Bye. Okay. Arvac is literally the only horse you ever need because you can just summon him wherever you are. Queen and see. It's that's oh, down there. Um, hmm. Okay, that's gonna be awkward. Can't go down there. I have to go around, and of course now they're all irritated. He's already made a move. I'm block. Oh, that was that was a lot of damage. Yes, we have to go inside. I mean, that would make sense. Shadow Mayor should probably be gender fluid at this point. Got off my high horse. Ha <laughs> ha. Sworn bastards all up in here. Hello, you're gonna die in the middle of your animation. Oh, and. Oh, I got disarmed and killed. Wow. Okay. What was that? Uh, let's do some heat. Someone there? Give up while you still can. Hey, you're dead. Now who is you? Briarheart, Briarheart Mage, I guess. Okay, you're dead. Oh, what? Oh, she knocked me down. That's what happened. you. Um, I was going to do something with him. What? Um, spirit fire. There we go. Ow. There you go. You're kind of trapped in... Oh, he is totally dead now. Oh, that was nice. He got trapped in there and actually... Can you come out of there? Freaky. 
Okay, never mind. I, I didn't need to loot him. It's the fourth arrow. We gotta, gotta have the correct pronouns. And that is what we're looking for. Nice. Ooh, that briar heart was nasty, though. Oh, good God. I am so sorry to everybody who has headphones on. I just punched my, my mic again. I, I seriously, I need to move this mic. Uh, where is the exit? Why am I... Why am I completely lost? Oh, there it is. I hope everybody um, still has their hearing. Smite the mic. My ears got smote. Yeah, I, I, near, I need to move the position of my mic because this is... <laughs> I just start flailing around, which is natural for me, you know? Okay, that is done. Nice, man, we're making some progress, guys. Making some serious progress. We've got to defeat a summoner. We're making a lot of progress, actually. At the hour 38 minute mark, I think we've cleared off like half a dozen, half a dozen. Oh, ah, I'm so sorry, my girl. I did not realize they had a trap for horses there. Smote, smitten, smited, smatted, smatten, smut. Smoten. Get Smoten. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I uh, forgot to have a moment of silent reflection for uh, bringing the session, this session of the Church of Smite into, into, into session. Yes. All rise. Lore-wise, can restoration magic reattach cut limbs? Hmm. I don't know. Huh. Whoa! Excuse me. Leave my dog alone. What are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I'm just protecting my dog from a madman. What I'm doing. I. That is a really, really good point, Five Arm. I absolutely need to. Two visions of healing, I guess? That seems to be pretty good. And let's also have... Spirit Fire ready to go. And let's also save. Is we need to, like, pray for some extra... strength. And... I... Or light on. I know there's light like literally shining off of us, but oh yeah, this thing. Literally just flip all these switches until something works.
Oh, it might be... That? be paying attention to what what this is doing. Ah, there we go. One, three, four, two. Daedra, though, is kind of cool. Actually, hang on. There was a book. I've already read that. Yep. That'll do it. Get a mace into the face and, you know. That did not do anything. Casting. That's really not doing anything. Morphogenesis. I want your power. Oh, you're dead. Go. It's the middle one. No one ever thinks to use the middle one. Mace crushing your skull does tend to have uh, sort of a negative impact on your your life goals from that point forward. Oh, hello. Do you need uh, some spirit fire, friend? Yeah, you can you trap him by any chance? That'd be ideal. He's casting things. I still have to get, still taking magic. Hmm. Okay, let's strengthen up Freaky for this fight. It's draining his. Oh, it's draining his magic now. Oh, that'll take care of you. Just like that. Wow. Okay then. And uh, the spider is like totally cool. Lingering fire. Don't know if I know uh, if I have that one. Okay. Quest completed. See you guys later. Definitely one of the hardest locks I have ever got, had my hands on. Okay. Oh, this is also... Wait, can I just open this with the key? Oh. Of course I can. Which is... Oh, hello. 
There's more of them. Did I hit you? No. Is dropping from the ceiling. That's always a good sign. Do we actually need to continue to explore this place? I don't think so. I think we're. I think we did whatever we need. Oh, that's 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 that. that no, let me get back up. Thank you. I want to go the other way. Time for dinner. Have a great dinner, Unlimited. Glad you could join us for a little while. We'll see you next time. Dragon's Blood, I'm watching this and trying to figure out if I want to do a Tempest Mage spell sword or Battle Mage. What's a Tempest Mage? Uh, I think I turned the wrong way. Wind and lightning. Okay. Book of Curses. Location marked on my map. Of Curses. Debilitation. Curse a target to cripple their speed and stamina. Cast with health instead of magicka. This effect can kill you. What mod's that from? I smashed a spider through the floor and it teleported to the ceiling. Okay. See you later, Damien. Hope you hope all goes well with your modding adventures. And it added a map marker. Alright, well, whatever. Curse definitely stinks of Daedric influence. That's pretty cool though. It um, reduces, what was it again? It reduces their speed, it cripples their speed and stamina and it's a blood magic spell. That's pretty neat. So it added a map marker. I mean, that could be anywhere. Chillwind Depths? Maybe? Okay, well, um, I guess we'll head... Somehow, get this, go this way. Hey, you waited for me. Thank you, my queen. Wish I could bow to you. That'd be great. But instead, I'll just ride you off of a staircase. That does sound like a really cool mage build. Boy. Oh. Making... 
a weird direction. Can I go up here and around? Yeah, looks like it probably will, will work. I wish the dirt paths were a little more obvious with this map mod. Is Forgotten Magic available for Xbox? Because it has um, it has uh, both lightning and frost magic. looks like the place I have seen the mini map I saw the mini map in a screenshot and I was like whoa there's a mini map for Skyrim do you recommend it is it is it good Ah, uh, too bad. Forgotten Ma Forgotten Magic is an old mod, so uh, even even it just being on uh, Skyrim Special Edition is thanks to a, a, a porter because the original mod author is uh, MIA to the modding scene. You're using mini map. Is there a way to get the mini map where it has uh, compass directions? Because I thought I could maybe I was I was thinking about using it if I could use it instead of having the compass activated. Oh, there's a big bear. Alright, Bear of the North, um, I'm gonna go this way, and you're gonna stay over there, and we're not going to, uh, I don't know, this, this thing is way too dangerous for any travelers. Way too dangerous for any travelers. Oh god. Oh, he got down and did that whole, uh, did that animation for basically skinning it. That's awesome. Ooh. Does Bears of the North wi work with, um, work with, um, does that, I mean, does that animation work with, uh, Hunterborn by any chance? I wonder. That'd be pretty cool if it did. I mean, I guess, uh, Hunterborn does have its own animation, but... Still, it's kind of cool. It's like um, the, it's kind of similar to the animation that that Geralt does when he takes a trophy from a creature. Huge bear. Yeah, Tom, I finally installed Bears of the North. We got the big scary bears now. I don't think, I don't think it affects their Oh, do we have to go in here? Yeah. I don't think it affects their... Um... Their stats. But it just makes them prettier. Bigger and better uh, fur. Better looking fur and everything. I have just the standard version one, not the 4K. Because I thought it's already causing a little bit of lag, so... Is it... 
Oh, it's not down. Oh. No, that, is that alive? It's alive. Okay. <gasps> Keep him there. I will spirit fire his butt. Oh. Oh, that was the. Uh... He has the horn of Stendar. Put the horn in the collection chest. Okay. You know, I never played the Dragon Age Inquisition. I heard good things and bad things for, about it. Okay, that is... I think that's everything. Good grief. Except for this. And I guess technically that. But yeah, we've... We've cleared the entire reach of all the quests we had active. We do need to talk to Atar. And we do need to kill the uh, leader of Red Eagle. There's another amulet over there. But I think I'm actually going to wrap up the stream a little bit early. So I've got a slight headache. It's probably because there's like a massive thunderstorm uh, coming in later today because it's been so hot and humid. So uh, I would like to thank everybody for stopping by today and joining me for this adventure. Apparently I'm thirsty now too. <laughs> At least Augustus is. Thank you once again to GG for the extremely generous donation in addition to being a regular member. Thank you very much. I massively appreciate it. It does help to uh, pay the bills and everything. Um... What else? Tomorrow we got more of the Forgotten Cryomancer, of course. We're slowly getting towards the end of that. Uh, and then we'll be doing the, the Druid, moving on to that. Anyway, I hope you guys have a great morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are. And, uh... Yeah. Another $30?! Good God, man! Of course, hearts! Okay! GG is MVP for the stream. Wow. That's crazy, dude. I have played Dragon Age Origins, at least part way. Uh, never, never saw it, never played 2 or Inquisition. Anyway, awesome guys, and thank you once again, GG. Hope you have a great day, all of you. And uh, I, if Awesome's still in the chat, I hope you have a good evening. All right, guys. Take care, everybody. We will see you uh, in another stream next week, of course. Take care.